welcome everyone to my channel that is fast and easy maths which is dedicated to give you tips and tricks related to mathematics so students today i'm going to show you a multiplication trick and trust me after using this trick you will be able to do these kind of calculations in like instantly okay like literally orally so here i can tell you the answer for this one is 1649 okay you might be thinking i have written down the answer somewhere that's not true let's take something else um what if i take uh, 3271 the answer for this one is 23 sorry 72 04 okay the only thing for this trick to work is there are two things which you need to remember the unit digits of both your multiplier and your multiplicand has to be same okay in both the cases if you see here also there was 7 here also there is 7 here also you saw this was 2 and 2 okay and the next thing which you need to remember is that the tens digit should add up to 10 3 plus 7 gets you 10 9 plus 1 also gets you 10 okay so how does this trick work basically what you have to do is let me do this one more time 97 into 17 okay so what you do over here is you multiply 9 into 1 which you get you 9 and then you add the number which is getting which is the unit digit which is like you know same for both of them so 9 into 1 plus 7 so 9 plus 7 that gets you how much 16 this is one part of your answer and the next part is nothing but square of the last digit which is 49 So similarly over here 3 into 7 gets you 21 add 2 to it you get 23 and the <coughs> the next part will be what square of 2 which is 4 but since this is two digit into two digit your answer will be into the form of four digits okay so here instead of writing just 4 we will write 0 4 okay so very quickly um let's try one more 65 into 45 okay So six six into four gets you. Just put this sign. Six into four gets you twenty four plus five gets you twenty nine, and then just five square, which is twenty five. So you saw how easy this trick is, students. If you like the way I'm explaining, then please go ahead and hit the like button because that gives me tremendous amount of encouragement in doing these kind of videos. Also, students, a lot of you are. Uh, you know keep asking like you know exactly how is this trick working or how do i get to you know all these tricks so very simple at the end of this video i will explain you the theory behind this okay the, the, the theory behind this trick okay also don't forget at the end of this video i'm going to put up a diy question whose answer you can mention in the comment section okay so now let's try one more so 58 into 58 So five into five is twenty-five plus eight gets you what thirty-three, and then eight square, which is sixty-four. So you saw how brilliant this trick is. You can do this with in seconds. Okay, just you need to remember the logic is that the unit digit has to be same and the tens digit should add up to ten. Okay, so let me try one more thing. Um. Let's do twenty-three and eighty-three. Okay, so we get what? Two into eight is sixteen. Sixteen plus three gets you nineteen, and the square of three is nine. But since this is two digit into two digit, we'll write down in the form of two digit only. So nineteen zero nine is your answer for this one. Okay, so now let's very quickly understand how does this happen. So please. See, look over here. I'm going to take my first multiplicand as 10a plus b, and the next one can be 10p plus b. Correct? Because the unit digit is same. And here the criteria is uh, where a plus b gets you 10. Okay. Now let's expand this. I'm just drawing a line over here. So that's how you get is ten hundred a p plus ten a into b so ten a b plus 
b into 10 into p so that gets you 10 p b plus b square okay so this is a if you are getting confused okay so now over here we'll write this as it is 10 hundred a p here if you look closely i can take uh, 10 and b common so let's do that 10 b i'm left with a plus p plus b square so this is 100 a p plus 10 b instead of a plus p i can write down it is nothing but 10 itself plus b square right so now i'm getting what 100 a p plus 100 b plus b square so now we can say that we can take 100 outside and i'm left with a p plus b plus p square right and if you look closely i was making you all do the same thing i was just making you all do this multiplication first adding the units digit that's what happened right a into p plus b and then just the b square okay so students see this is a like this is very rarely i give you all the proper explanation if you really like to if you really want me to do that then please please put a yes in the comment section or you can even go and hit hit the like button so that i know that this is something which you all like okay because most of the students are like really interested in the trick and they don't really care about how is this happening okay so if you really want me to do that this takes a lot of effort so and you know it makes the video also a bit lengthy so if you don't want me to do that then you can just put a no otherwise just put a yes in the comment section i'll understand and that is something like if i if i read a quite a lot of yes for this particular video i'm going to show these kind of uh, theory behind each and every trick uh, more often or probably i'll try to do that for most of my videos okay so i hope you all have gotten this okay so now time for your diy the question over here is i want you all to tell me what is the answer for 47 into 67 okay very quickly use the particular trick and write down your answers in the comment section one more time just remember this trick will only work when the digits in the units place is same and the digits in the tens place add up to the digit which is 10 okay so i hope you have understood this very very clearly and in case you have any other doubts please let me know so in the comment section so that's it for now i'll very soon see you with another video about a trick with mathematics okay bye